Hey love bugs, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley B. Deck. Thank you for tuning in. Today we'll be doing a start to finish install courtesy of Eunice Hair. They sent over this beautiful closure wig. It's a body wave texture, but as you guys can see, we're going to turn it up a notch with some curls. So if you're interested in seeing how we got this look, keep on watching. Jumping right into it, I am so hype about this highlighter from Fenty. This is my first time using it. I think it's called Trophy Wife. I'll have it in the description box, but it literally looks like gold and water on my skin. I love it so much. This is the box and the packaging, and this is the free goodies. I'll show you all about that at the end of the video. But for now, let's focus on the wig at hand. This one here is a pre-cut lace body wave wig. It is a closure at that, and as you guys can see, the body wave is definitely body wave wave in this is Eunice's air wig it comes in a 4x4 four four or a 6x4x5 four closure that is a mouthful but you can definitely get two different options with this one it also includes this adjustable elastic band in the back you guys already know I like to secure that first over my braids and then I put the rest of the wig on and this is what she looks like on as I mentioned the body wave is body waving I love when the wig has a nice good natural texture from here I'm going to go ahead and start the customization process for me even though I'm wearing an HD wig cap it definitely is lighter than my complexion and the lace on this wig is so amazing that you can definitely see through so I went ahead and buffed a little bit of my foundation powder in my shade onto that wig cap so that it would just be a better blend on top of the wig now I'm going to go ahead and bond her down I did use the even on this one and I, and I sprayed a generous amount I applied the wig on top and then I just went ahead and used this portable fan to go ahead and air dry because this one had a decent fit to it it didn't need too much to dry I feel like when a wig is super big and bulky I really need my heavy duty blow dryer to really give me some action to go ahead and bond it down but for this one since it kind of fit good I just needed it to get tacky and I knew that it would be able to dry the rest of the way on its own now I'm going to go in and extend the parting as I mentioned this one comes with a 4x4 closure or you can get it as a 6x4 4.5 uh, closure I know that was a mouthful you can check the description box for all the specs on this one once I went ahead and bonded it down and I went ahead and did the dynamic duo in the parting we are now ready to curl I did add a little bit of Sebastian shapers to the entire length of the hair before I started the curling process now I'm not sure if this is what I was supposed to do or not you guys know I'm not professional with curls at all and so that is my mission this summer is to really get it right I did these two curls and I already see I was starting now bad so I was like let me just start over because I don't know if the curling iron was still heating up and it wasn't hot enough my angles aren't right but I just definitely felt like it wasn't going to come out good with those curls so I did start over and I am taking like nice size sections they're not too small but they're also not too big I kind of feel like in order to get the best curls um you got to straighten it out first in a sense of like the body wave is body waving so like the wavy texture in the root versus the curls kind of can clash a little bit if you really really want it to be really nicely I would also recommend like blow drying it if you don't want to straighten it out here I just went in directly to those body wave um, waves and I just curled on top I did add a little bit more shapers to each section as I combed it out and I did kind of leave it on for a good amount of time for the sake of the video I did kind of cut through as much of the curling process as I could so you can kind of get the drift of what I'm doing and how I got the curls but you can also not be bored with you know being here forever and as you guys can see I have focused on like different sections so I start at the very top um, with the curling iron and I'll show you here hopefully I didn't cut this clip too much but you see I start at the top and I curl it I let it sit there for a minute so that the curl can set then I move it down and curl a little bit more and I just work my way down so that each section of the hair gets a nice amount of time with that curling iron so that the eye so that the entire thing is curled all the way through and I did like I said medium sized pieces they're not too big but they're also not too small I love the way they came out and then I again added the shapers a little bit more I think this is the first time I use a lot of hairspray usually I don't use this much and I did love the way these came out I did the opposite side off camera and as you'll see um, once I comb them out 
the opposite side didn't come out as good as the first side so after I start the outro I did go back in off camera and fix those um, so that I can have like a flawless look but again practice makes perfect and that's how I got so good with installing wigs so I know I can go in and get really good with the curls as well I just got to put more energy into it here I am just adding a little bit of concealer in the parting as well as powder along the hairline the powder that I'm using is a foundation a shade darker than my complexion from Ruby Kiss I have all the details on everything we used in the description box here I am showing off the curls it gives Shirley Temple vibes for sure and I'm just going to go ahead and comb them out I love the way they came out also if I don't mention later use code air 15 at checkout trust me you'll get some money off and you'll get a free robe that's definitely player so don't forget to use my code it definitely will give you some money and a nice robe first of all bing bong I actually curled my hair and I like it well I like this side more than this side but I'm not gonna just I'm just not gonna touch this side because I still have to take pictures and I don't a lot of times like I'll go in and touch it up and then it'll be like a rabbit hole of like touch up this piece and touch up this piece and then like it's an, an, another hour later and I'm still not satisfied so I'm very satisfied with the way this side came out I think I I think I got it I just got to keep practicing I keep saying I've been saying that literally for like four years and still I cannot curl hair but anyways this one came from Eunice and this was the dust bag again we're trying to go fast and not have like 10 minutes of talking because why this is the packaging you guys already know if you rock with me you rock with Eunice you guys have seen all of this before and then inside we do get some goodies I always love it when I see these boxes it's like getting jewelry on like a special holiday they did include the HD wig caps and then they included this goodie bag the goodie bag always um is loaded but what goodies but inside they did give a melt belt that says Eunice on it a second pack of wig caps these nice um Eunice lashes which are nice and full and thick and then a little oh, and then a little kabuki brush and then here they did give let's see what we get today oh we got some Eunice earrings and so we literally are working on the whole collection so I've had the I think I have a necklace I for sure have an earring, us uh, or a uh, earrings, a ring, and now I have some like earrings that say Eunice. Super cute. You see, it says Eunice with the logo. That's really cute. Anyways, um, and then you also seen they did give me the robe, which I think I lost it at this point. But you guys seen the robe already? Where did it go? If you didn't already, this is the the robe. And again, I have a collection of these. So with the hair, I do love the fact that it holds a curl, obviously. Now, also what's great about this one is that it's pre-cut lace, which means that I didn't have to cut the lace out. I didn't have to cut the lace off at all. It already came good to go. Um, and then with the parting and everything like that, it was just super simple and easy. So I do have this one linked in the description box. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Also, I do want to mention that they do have a special going on. You enter Air 15 at checkout and not only will you get um, a discount, you also get the nice little robe that I just showed you. So make sure you get your discount. Make sure you get your free robe. You do have to enter that code at checkout and you will get it with your purchase. I hope you guys are enjoying your spring break with your kids. If you do have kids, mine are off next week, so this should be hectic but fun. Thank you guys so much for watching and sticking around and hanging out with your girl. Also, don't forget to check out the description box for a direct link to this. Also, don't forget to check out the description box for that coupon code I told you guys about and also list and links of everything we used to complete this look. Again, I'm delirious. So thank you guys so much for watching and as always, I'll see you in the next one. Smooches.